State. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant, sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we begin our day again with a mixed bag. The mix goes like this. You have the Dow up 37 points, and the Tranny's up 81. The other U.S. indices are trading to the downside. The S&P's off three points. No big deal there. It's basically flat. 15 points for the NASDAQ. That's pretty much flat as well. The Russell's off 32 pennies, so that is definitely flat. Some is not flat. They're down seven tenths percent, trading out at uh, 55. 70 it's down about 40 points out there if we take a good goldilocks off 26 bucks silver's up a dollar two that's down three and three tenths percent light tree crude is up about 44 pennies trading out at 81.73 natural gas is back two cents the 30-year treasury is off seven ticks print out at 119.19 let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel Market update chart will begin with the ES Mini upper left-hand side. There is a new profile that's attempting to form, just like yesterday there was a new profile that was attempting to form that did not hold. Now, at this stage here on this black background charts, and I've got different profile levels on my white background charts, let's just use the data we have here. You've got support at 5079, resistance up at 5197. Spot Volatinix at this moment in time has tested and rejected the 50-day exponential moving average. The 50-day at the moment is printed out at 1333, so that's the level to be watching. If price continues to stay below it, well, um, we're likely to see the S&P 500, the S-mini, trade sideways to actually higher. If we take a look at the NQ, the NQ also forming a new profile. Now, this one is actually formed. The ES-mini, it's an attempt. We won't have confirmation on that until Sunday, but that's not the case with the NQ. Again, I have different profile levels. In this chart here, 20.029 is support. We're trading at 20.015. If we take a look at U.S. dollar index, it's finally been able to make it above the center of that weekly profile. And a close today above the 105. 522 could be signaling to you and I that uh, we're likely headed up towards the, uh, well, really a close above 105.42 would trigger a new A to B equals CD pattern on the upside, but at uh, gives you a price projection for 106.91. But we do recall that you've got uh, price trading inside the sell zone of its weekly profile, so that resistance is between 105.48 and 106.15. Gold is a consolidation with inside its daily profile. That's between 23.14 and 23.86. Silver pulling back, giving back yesterday's wonderful gains. Really the same with Goldilocks, but silver still remains above the top of its profile. Lights recruit. Today, whatever that high is, that's going to go ahead and complete a TD9 count top. And if we take a look at natural gas, it's approaching support. Support, support is down at 276. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Said Show. We you drop to start your Friday. Have a fabulous one, a fantastic weekend, and we we'll look forward to seeing you again on Monday. We'll be right back.